Radio. Welcome to another exciting episode of Coffin Radio. I am Heartthrob Rob, and today we are watching Young Rock Season 2, Episode 1, Unprecedented Fatherhood. The bio here reads, As the 2032 election nears, Dwayne reflects on what it means to be a father. In, in 1984, little Dewey vies for his father's attention. In 1987, teenage, Dewey arri- teenage Dwayne arrives in Nashville. And in 1996, adult Dwayne struggles in Canadian Football League. Pretty good episode here, man. I'm just more stoked to get everybody back. Dude, season two of Young Rock. I'm super stoked. I love The Rock. First things first, I love the entire cast here. The standouts to me are always The Rock's mother, played by Stacey, uh, and uh, Rock's dad, Rocky Johnson, played by... I'm sorry, I forget the actor's name, but he's just so good. Both actors are so good. Everyone here is incredible, but, but those two just stand out to me. It's cool to see The Rock in here. Um, just really good stuff. It's not the funniest episode in the entire universe, but it was just enough to get everybody back. And you're telling three different storylines here, you know? So you have to get everyone back on the same page. As we start off with Young Dewey, uh, Dad's doing good in the WWF. He's now the champion, but he's still on the road, man. He's the tag team champion with Tony Atlas. Tony Atlas is in here. It seems like Young Rock or Young Dewey here is very, very, very jealous of his dad being out on the road and, you know, maybe spending time with Tony Atlas. It seems like he's a little bit jealous there. As we skip in farther, as we get uh, Dewey at 16, uh, Dwayne, excuse me, as we get The Rock at 16 years old, he is now moving to the Memphis territory with his father and we get to meet downtown Bruno. We get to meet Harvey Whippleman uh, in the Memphis territory and it looks like dad is still, you know, hustling and doing his thing, chasing that dollar. But Dewey has to get used to this Memphis living. So it looks like we're going to have some problems there. And as grown up, this is where it seems to be the most problem for Dewey. At last season, he gets cut from the NFL uh, and is now working for the Canadian Football League. And the Canadian Football League, he's just not getting it too quickly, man. The rules are different. You know, more spaces, farther, more team members, farther back from this, farther back from that. He's used to American, and he doesn't make the cut, and he gets cut from the team and actually has to be on the practice squad. So he gets his money taken down from this to this. He gets paid less. But we also get introduced to his future wife, Danny, um, on this episode. It's very good to see her, but it seems like um, the problem here for him is, you know, trying to get back on the team and trying to get at it. Also, you know, they show The Rock in 2032 and he's running for president. And I think his name is Sean Astin. He was the Goonie and he was in, uh, what's it called when you're at the Upside Down? You know what I'm talking about, that kid's show, Stranger Things. He was in that show as well. It seems like he's a hater online that went to school with Dewey and he says, I have a story to tell. So we'll see where that comes in from The Rock, problems for The Rock. I give this it was a good episode, man. Not the funniest thing in the entire world, but it has to bring you back, has to show you. I wish they would have had a two-hour season premiere here because, uh, excuse me, an hour premiere here because there's so much to digest. There's so much going on with only a 30-minute episode, 22 minutes in all reality, 8, 16, 24. Everyone gets less than eight minutes for their storyline. So it's a lot to fit in here, uh, closer to seven minutes probably with uh, everything else that's going on. But um, I'm still excited, man. It's Young Rock Season 2. Shout out to all the cast. Shout out to everybody. I love this show. I just wish there was more of it. But let me know what you guys think, man. What do you think you got planned for this season? Who's your favorite actor or actress? I already know who mine is. Um, and what, what do you like about this show? You know, the whole cast is back. So let me know what you guys think. We'll talk about it in the comments. But make sure you like and subscribe. And, or if you like what you're watching, then hop in the coffin. Follow us on social media. At Coffin Radio. Coffin spelled with a K. And that's all for today. Radio.